prison school chapter 203 excuse me though um the longest schoolyard a situation i am not thankful for this cover page man such a such a great cover page man <laughs> um whoever this is she looks kind of like pregnant or something she definitely looks like she's pregnant um but this is i'm so hyped right now because the cavalry battle is finally getting underway and um i mean hopefully this chapter is just gonna be like we're actually gonna get to see the cavalry battle like in action like hopefully it doesn't go over to like the chairman stuff like i just want to focus on this on this whole like everything is just coming like full circle to this point in this arc so like I just want it to happen already. All right, so first page. Let the cavalry contest between the above ground student council and the underground student councils begin. And Mari, Mari is on the front line. Okay, seriously, what, what is PBR someone going to do in this? Um, all right, so from my understanding um, with these uh kind of like battles that they do over in japan i'm pretty sure it's just in japan right that they do this but it's only the people that they're holding on top that can actually like rip off the headbands like the people who are holding up like mari and like pbr sama like they can't do anything all they all they're doing is holding up the people on top so like they're already basically at a disadvantage because it's just Mari and I think that's Anzu on the top. Yeah, so it's basically them two are the only ones that can actually pull headbands off. So, like, what is PBR song like even gonna do? Like, the boys are so fucking stupid for that. Um, Alright. Don't worry, Mieko. Calm down. Did you hear the vice president just cried? Uh, she totally regressed to a little girl. How do they? How do they know about that? Um, if she's like that, even we can beat her. Infinite carbonated drink supply system activate. Mm, Maiko's revival complete. Dude, she is fucking back. Move out. Huh? The vice president. She's been revived. Who? Who said she was weak? That girl's a liar. Um. Uh, oh no, she's coming this way. I'm scared. Uh, no, not this way. Amazing. The intensity of the revived vice president is overwhelming them. Um, their horses are falling on their own. Oh, okay, so that's a good way to knock out a couple fodder for sure. Um, okay, so Chio is the one that's on top, not Anzu. All right. Um,. Yeah, I'm really interested to see how, like, Andre's role in it. Jesus Christ, dude, look at how big Andre is. <laughs> like, everyone else is just, like, little ants. And, like, Andre looks like fucking, like, Godzilla or something. <laughs> um, Alright, how can this be? They truly haven't laid a finger on us yet. <laughs> uh, it's just like I said, we'll defeat you without laying one finger on you. The ICDSS is a grand success. Uh, well, I had predicted this much, as did I. However, well, for something created in an emergency, the ICDSS is quite well built. Uh, you have discovered a new possibility for plastic bottles, boys. Well, we indeed but concentrated on the essence of PBR uh, de development technologies now then let us continue like this straight to where kate awaits yes ma'am uh what are you doing we massively outnumber them so hurry up and settle the matter yes ma'am come at us <clears throat> indeed does someone does someone have their arm on top of pbr sama's head already that's what it looks like it looks like they just went straight for PBR Sama. Um, it looks like they're attacking Chio too. Is that Chio? I think it is. Um, 
Now Mieko, once more. I see DSS activate. She's choking on it? God damn, dude. I mean, it is kind of like they're waterboarding her with, like, carbonated sodas, basically, right? Um, something's coming out. It's acidic? Mako, are you alright? Did I push you too hard? Is she, like, throwing up? I'm sorry, this is hard to drink. It's getting into weird places and I can barely breathe. Um, the problem might be that the duck... The duct is too thick and too long. When we designed its size, we focused on looks and the volume of liquid that she can take. But of course, things would get pretty rough if she's drinking while moving. Yeah, that is true. Um, that's right. So if I suck up too much liquid, I start choking. Also, my glasses fog up and I can't see where I'm going. What did you say, man? This is, <laughs> this is way too sexual, man. Um... This system is a, is a disaster. Um, it is riddled with deficiencies. What? Didn't we discover a new possibility for plastic bottles? Indeed, we did. Uh, you showered us with praise not terribly long ago. Um, yet now, this is nothing more than garbage. <laughs> Holy shit. Um, this matter will be settled by making her drink it directly. Now then, Mieko. Oh shit, she, needs, she doesn't even have pupils anymore. Uh, let us maintain this pace. Go straight to Kate and settle this. Dude, she looks like a beast right now, for real. Dude, I don't I don't even know like how how are they winning? Like all the like the army that the above ground student council has to do is just like bone rush Mari. Just like circle her. And they can easily take her out. Like, <laughs> like these girls are pretty fucking stupid. Um, stay away from me. I am really scared. Uh, what are you doing? You only, you need only all attack her at once. That's exactly what I'm saying. If you would come, if you would come, then have at me. Mako and I should take you on. Oh, dude, she's throwing it back up. Mieko. See, I knew, I knew she looked, uh, I knew the cover page, whoever was on it, looked pregnant. And that's exactly, like, she's just drinking too much. <laughs> My tummy is all full. I don't think I can drink any more carbonated drinks. What did she say? Um, shoot. Coupled with everything from before the cavalry contest began, the vice president must have had at least... Five liters of pop. No, oh, shit. No wonder she's got a flabby. That's true. Um, This is because you boys got too into things and had her drink. How can you say that? You are the one who had her drink the most, President. That's true. You said any carbonated drink would work. How dare you talk back to the President? Um, Indeed, what has transpired over there? It would appear that what I feared has begun. Oh yeah, what what happened to his whole ant prophecy thing? Um, uh, could it be? Is this indeed that of which you spoke earlier, Joe Donald? The prophecy of the ants. Tell us what the prophecy is, man. Um, it is at this rate the underground student council will lose. Uh, Mako, are you all right? As for why the ants have given this prophecy, the revived Veep is but an illusion. Mako. Um, only her external appearance has returned. My tummy is all bubbly. I feel sick. <laughs> um, within, she remains in infantilized. Okay. Um. Yeah, I forgot the 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 ant prophecy. Like at first, like. When they first said it, like, a couple chapters ago, it was, um, basically that the Underground Student Council was gonna lose, right? That was the prophecy, I think, if I remember correctly. Um, but now Joe is also saying that, like, on the outside, the vice president is, like, back to normal, like, her face 
and just like her demeanor but like inside she's still that like whiny whiny um kid that she was before she met mari and um i mean if you didn't think that they were at a disadvantage before they are even now even more at a disadvantage because and they basically lost the vice president if they even had her to begin with um so i literally don't know how they're gonna get out of this um i i think it would be a good idea if instead of mari they put hannah on top if they hold up hannah instead because i think hannah would go the fuck in for sure and um Fucking, what's their names? Uh, Joe, Gaguto, and Shingo, they need to take PBR down and they need to hoist someone else up there. Because PBR someone is not going to get the job done. Like, I just don't know, like, are they, how did the president just let that go? Like, you would think the president would be like, after seeing PBR someone up there, she would be like, no, you guys need to get, like, a real human being up there and not a fucking bottle. Like, I'm, just, I'm shocked that she hasn't said anything about that. Um, I mean, all, all respect to PBR Sama. Like, I'm not trying to shit on him, but let's be real. Like, he's not alive. He doesn't have any fucking arms. So, like, what is he going to do? Um, but, yeah, I don't know, man. Pretty, pretty good chapter, though. Um. We're finally getting into the battle, and um, we haven't dealt with Kate yet, so I'm really excited to see, like, where this is going, and um, I mean, obviously, the Ant Prophecy is going to be wrong, right? Like, they're going to pull out with the win some way, so I, I'm just interested to see how it's going to happen, and the reason why I like... Um, Akira Hiromoto, I think his name is. Like, this manga cuts so much. It's just, like, how he thinks things through is so, like, genius sometimes. So, I know it's not going to be a bullshit reason for them to pull out this win. It's going to be something really thought out. So, I'm really excited to see um, just how the Underground Student Council is going to pull this out. So, um, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, all that stuff. And I'll see you guys for the next chapter. Peace.